everything that goes up has to come down. But why? Every single time I hit a ball upwards, it comes back to the ground. Why does this happen? If you have these questions in mind, then you're at the right place. Because that's what we're going to be learning today. Welcome to Kids Easy Learning. Make sure to subscribe to be a part of our KEL family and give this video a huge thumbs up. Because we post new videos every Thursday. Try throwing a ball in the air. It comes back down to the ground. This is because of gravity. Yes, it's that simple. But what is gravity? What do you mean by gravity? So it all started when a scientist called Isaac Newton was sitting under an apple tree and an apple fell on his head. And then he started thinking, why did the apple fall down and not up or sideways? That's when he realized that Earth's gravity pulled the apple and made it fall on his head and not sideways or upwards. From this incident, we can conclude that gravity is a type of force which pull the apple towards the ground. But what kind of force is it? And what does this force actually do to the objects? We know that force is a push or pull. When you hit something with a hammer, it is a push. When you go to the river to do some fishing, you pull the fish out of the water. So this is a pull. Both these are an application of force. So force is something we commonly see every day. Now gravity is also a kind of force. In front of you, you can see two balls. Both these balls are pulling each other. The first ball is pulling the second ball and the second ball is pulling the first ball towards itself. This is because of the gravitational force between the two objects. We can say that gravity is an attractive force between any two masses. So anything that has mass also has gravity. Like this football here and this piece of block, both of them have mass and hence also have gravity. However, objects with more mass have more gravity. Now let's talk about Earth's gravitational force. Now we know that any two objects that has mass pulls the other object or attracts it towards itself. This attractive force is gravity. And we also know that when there is more mass, there is also more gravity. Really big objects like planets, especially Earth, has a lot of gravitational force. Which is why objects are attracted to Earth. And it is also the reason why we are standing on Earth and not floating around. Now let's come back to this table tennis bat and ball. Can you try answering the question to why the ball comes down every time we push it up? You're right, it is because of the gravitational pull of Earth. Thanks for watching. Make sure to search for Kids Easy Learning whenever you want to watch educational videos. Make sure to subscribe to join the KEL family and give this video a huge thumbs up. We post new videos every Thursday, so make sure to come back next Thursday for more.